a Karate Doomfist skin. So let's check out to see what is new first and foremost. So we have a Bastion, a Bastion skin called Sand Castle. So look at this thing. It's supposed to be like he's uh, made out of sand. I get it. That's very cool. So we got Bastion, Sandcastle. The Ganymede has little sunglasses on with a tank top. I like it. The weapons are... Our weapons, obviously, the uh, the turn mode looks like this. Looks pretty cool. This is actually pretty cool for an epic skin. We got a rumbling over here as well. Okay, this is looking good. Also, guys, make sure you vote down below in the chat which one do you think is the best. What do you guys vote, rate this? 1 out of 10. 1 out of 10 on the Sandcastle Bastion skin. Uh, next up, we have Orissa. <laughs> she, has, she literally has ice cream on her head. I love this. Dude, the, the epic skins are getting nice and juicy. So we got Orissa with ice cream on her head, a little cherry on top. We also got the little sash thing coming down with an ice cream cone on the back. It's actually some ice cream. Oh, you can see it from, the, from this side too. All right, we got a little Orissa. What's on her? Okay, she's got something going on there. She also has kind of like this netted fence foot type looking thing, but really the main key of this, the, the main uh, the main point of this one is a chair on top. Guys, rate this one one out of 10 as well. I wanna see what you guys think is the best out of all of them. Let's check out Union Jack, the final epic skin before we jump into the legendary skins of the Summer Games 2024 Tracer. So Union Jack, okay, okay. You guys remember the whole like flag series we had from way back in the original uh, Overwatch Summer Games way back in the day. You guys remember the McCree one, all these ones. Now we got Union Jack, the Tracer one. So she actually has the flag across the legs. Not bad. These are actually not too bad for epic skins at all. It's pretty cool, actually. So the first of the legendary skins that we have here. Oh, actually, rate this one one out of ten as well. The first legendary skin we have is Baptiste Tropical. <laughs> it's Baptiste on his little vacation. He's going to Hawaii, and uh, he's got his little umbrella in the back we got the gun oh actually we didn't check out let's check out this i want to show you guys this just in case let me show you the weapons on this so that's tracers uh here we have this one let me show you this before we show about these we got all this right here as well little bongos right there all right now let's go back to baptiste so check him out he's got his cool chain wallet in the back he's got these big old boots that look like they're made out of um some kind of uh, straw or something. He's got the knee pads. He's got his little cool guy glasses. And it looks like he has the, the gun is made out of coconut. It's a coconut barrel on that with a little leaf dangling off the end of it. Interesting. This is actually, this one's all right. But I mean, compared to how good the Epic skins are here, I'd say it's probably about the same to me. Oh, look at the time. There's a time on his, his watch right there. All right. Next up after that. Oh, we can check this up closer actually. So Batiste, that actually I like the little the little dangling leaf on the front of it. Looks pretty good. The weapon is probably the coolest part of this entire skin, actually, right here. The chat says Batiste is a seven. Perfect skin, says Abdullah. Let's check out the next one. So next we have up is Bregita. Oh, so this is called Feskarn, which I'm assuming is a Swedish word. So she's got a little net for her silhouette on the back. Driftwood on the chest, a little hat with a fish on it. Love the weapon. Yeah, the weapon's pretty cool. This weapon's actually pretty cool too. So I wonder what this word, if you guys speak Swedish, let me know in the chat what this word means, Feskarn. And this looks cool. I like this too. Very summary. Oh, it means fish woman. Is that what it means? Okay, so apparently this is, oh, she's a fisherman woman. That's what it is. Okay, so this the net is for for uh for catching fish i guess oh we're getting low scores on this one we can see lots of fours and fives a six on this one you guys are saying six out of ten is the highest i've seen so far for this one seven out of eight that's actually the highest i've seen she's got the shoulder pads with the actual little um flotation devices whatever those things are called the back so this one's actually you guys are rating this lower than the batiste one interesting i think this one actually looks cooler than the batiste one to me Oh, and this is also like a flotation device as her shield. That's actually cool. This is the coolest part of it, of this skin for me, is the flotation device. If that's what that, I'm assuming that's what that's supposed to be. All right, so that is Bragita Fescarn, Fishwoman. Then we, okay. 
<laughs> this one is dope. You guys remember the old symbol, this little meteor symbol from, they've used this forever on the summer games. Um, that is actually, this is cool. This is called Doomfist Karate Skin. Oh, apparently it doesn't mean fish. Apparently that doesn't mean fisherwoman. Feskarn is the Gothenburg way of saying fish, fish Karen. Okay. I don't know what that means, but sure. So we have this. It says Karate SG 2020. Oh my God. The chat is popping off right now. Nines and tens. People like this one the most so far. This is probably my favorite one too, just because the concept of it looks really cool. Or the concept is good to begin with. So we have Nigeria 001. It's just straight up. It's a gi. He's just wearing, it's just Doomfist wearing a gi. He's got the black belt. What does that say on there? NKC. Somebody who can decode what NKC is here. And we have Karate SG 2020. Summer Games is obviously what SG I'm assuming means there. Doomfist is a 9. 9 out of 10. Because he's not a 10 because Doomfist has so many good skins. Interesting. Look at the little shoesies. This one's cool. I, I want this skin. Just to be able to karate chop around. I'm feeling this one. All right. Next up, we have the one that you may have seen, which is Echo. Echo surfs up in her Super Saiyan blue form. Oh, this is awesome. The wings are surfboards. All right, you guys, I want to see what your rating is on this. Wings are surfboards on this. That is, that is so dope. I love that. Wow. Okay. This one's really good. I mean, I've seen this one, so I'm kind of like... Uh, Hmm, I'm kind of torn because I think if I think if I hadn't already seen it, I probably would like this one even more than the Doomfist one. But this one's really good. I like that her hair. It kind of it does is like Super Saiyan blue, but Super Saiyan God blue or whatever the official term is. But it, actually, I think it's supposed to be water because you see the little water drop that's going up. Eight or nine, a four, a ten out of ten, a five. You guys are all over the place with this one. Nobody's on board with this. Guys, by the way, don't forget to drop a thumbs up on the stream and hit that notification bell. we got some really, really cool videos coming out soon, so please do hit that notification bell if you haven't already. But I like this one a lot. I would say this is one of my top two of the entire thing. This is really, really good. Probably Doomfist and this one are the, the two legendaries I want the most. And then next up, we have Farah. Farah actually has this skin. So this is called Farah's Lifeguard skin. Oh, and by the way, this is called Surf's Up, if I didn't mention that already. Surf's up skin from Echo. Very good. Uh, but the lifeguard skin is just like you'd expect. It's Farah as a lifeguard. But obviously, just because she's on duty doesn't mean she can take off her wings. She's got to keep those wings on. But the coolest part of the skin to me is the are these tubes in the back. This looks awesome. That is so awesome. Look at this, like the water pumping through these tubes. And not only is it on the wings itself, but it's actually on the back. I really like that. I still don't like it as much as the other two, but I'd say I like this one more than the Baptiste one for sure. She have <laughs> I just never saw this before. If you look at her feet, she actually has like suntan lines. Uh, I would say a four out of 10, a 10 out of 10. So you guys are all pretty much on board with the first ones, but you guys are getting split with these these newer ones or these, uh, af these ones coming down. Lifeguard on there, let's check out the weapon. Whoa, this weapon is actually pretty intricate. Uh, okay, it's got rope on here. Doomfist is the best one. What do you guys think is the best of the legendary so far? Let me know. So we got this little thing. Oh, it's like a walkie-talkie for the lifeguards would use. This little thing that you can put on your wrist. You don't lose it. It's actually a really detailed weapon for a ferret here. We're going to come back and we're going to check out more of these. But let's actually just check out the emotes, all the new emotes and victory poses and voice lines first. And we'll come back and I'll show you guys one more time at the end. But check this out. This is the new emote for... Uh, Tracer, apparently it's the only uh, emote we got going on here. So doing little stretches, doing all this stuff here. Look at the Lucio Ball map nickel. It's cursed. It's the remix one, right? We might do that in a separate video. I'll check it out for sure, though. Thank you, man. Um, so this is Tracer's. It's called Warm Up. She's doing a little warm ups. Not bad. Not bad. I like it. Uh, victory poses. So we have three new metal ones. You guys probably all remember these metal ones. Oh, dude, the little dog. I love the little dog. Kyle Crow, what's up, dude? Look at this little dog right here. He's got the metal. This is how selfless uh, Orissa is. The dog always gets the, the reward. Oh, this one's dope. I like this one. By the way, if you guys didn't get this Sigma skin, you missed out. You finally don't have to. He finally has shoes. You don't have to look at his little toesies anymore. This is actually really cool. I like this one. These are both 
good considering they're both in the metal thing. All right, so then we have Hammond up next with his. He's testing to see if it's real gold. <laughs> He's testing to see if it's real gold, just biting on it. Oh, that's cool too. All right, voice lines. I don't know if the volume is going to be loud enough. Let me check to see if we can get the volume loud enough so you guys can hear these voice lines real fast. Let me know if it is. Let me just test one. It's not that hot. You guys can hear that, right? If you can hear that type of one in the chat. Bullseye. Got a little bullseye. Best way to win is to rig the game. Got me some my. Oh, so there's a Midsummer one. That's cool. Has Brigitte mentioned Midsummer in a previous voice line? Probably, but happy Midsummer. Glad Midsummer. <laughs> you can't be serious. You picked the wrong side. Dude, this skin is still so dope. I love this. I love this Doomfist one. I don't know if I even want to change this off. If I even if I get the karate one, I don't know if I can leave this one behind. I'm going to break down tape of this. Imitate the best. <clears throat> and by the way, guys, if you don't know, we actually live stream uh, pretty much every day over on fb.gg slash onickel. I'll leave a link in the description if you guys ever want to join us. We play a bunch of different games, so check it out. We stream all the time. You learn something new every day. We usually don't stream here on YouTube unless it's on days like this. No job too big, no score too small. Doomfish. Four. Uh, oh, it's for when he golfs. <laughs> All right, what's the best voice line out of these guys? You guys can vote on that in the chat or in the comments, I mean. While you're doing that, let's check out the sprays. We got a couple new sprays. We got the Surf's Up spray here from, yeah, Midsummer was a while ago, though. Um, Diet Arsant. Surf's up, we got. That's pretty cool. I mean, Echo, they put her on the whole entire, like, surf, um, theme this time around. Taksamiket. Taksamiket. No lifeguard mercy. We got swimming. We got a little, uh, Sigma here swimming with this. Oh, dude, I thought that was his shoulder for a second. Oh my God. It was not. It's his. Wait, is it his shoulder? Wait, what is it? Why is his shoulder so huge? It's massive. It's a uh, Mike Stor. Can you show the skins again? Yeah, I'm gonna show the skins again right after we. I want to go through all the, these first though. We got goalkeeper. That's pretty cool. It's like you guys are watching the big green. It's kind of like that. I hope Echo won't wipe out. Me too. <laughs> we got Junkrat using his head. Remember, guys, always use your head. Always use your head. Thanks so much for showing us. No problem, man. Don't forget to drop a thumbs up, guys, if you haven't already. Drop a thumbs up, subscribe with notifications on, all that good stuff. And then I like this new Ganymede, dude. I like this little Ganymede with the sunglasses. He's got a little attitude. My man Baptiste looking fresh. Did you guys like that one the most, huh? Oh, <laughs> the ice cream one. So it's basically just taking the, the epic skins and turning them into... Oh, I didn't even think about that. Duh, that's his head. I was just looking at Ganymede only. It's actually his head. Ice cream. I like that one a lot. Union Jack. Oh, interesting. They turned this into like an emblem with the two guns behind. Then we have, uh, if you do, if you guys do play competitive Lucio Ball, if you compete, you can get this one. This is a competitor uh, spray. And if you become the hero, Copa Lucio Ball Hero 2020 is this. So the only thing we have left before we go check out the skins one last time is the highlight intros. The vacation highlight intro. Ice Cream Marissa is the most amazing thing I've ever seen, to be honest. What do you guys think is the best epic skin of all time? The best epic skin, not legendary. This is kind of cool. So this is Anna's Vacation. She's vibing out right here. I actually kind of like that. It looks sort of creepy with this skin, though, but I like it in general. Target Practice. This is the last one we got from Ash. Oh, that's awesome. That's really cool. I would use this. I would definitely use this. Which And also, between vacation and target practice, huh? I would say target practice for me, which is this one here. All right, let's go one last time. We're going to end this video. I don't want to make this too long. Let's make it nice and quick. So if you guys missed the skins, here we go. One, one time real quick. We got three epic skins this time around. One is Bastion's Sandcastle. Has Ganymede with the little sunglasses and a Sandcastle type head. Vote in the comments which one is your favorite of the epic skins and of the legendary skins these are the weapons i'm gonna go a little faster if you want to see the full um details you can go back and check the beginning of the video oh i never realized these are like kind of like the bucket handles right that's what those are supposed to be then we got this mode the jiggly mode then the next epic we have is ice cream a little ice cream on the head feeling it feeling it 
That's pretty much it. The back, you just see the ice cream from the back. Is there any other details we're missing here? I think that's pretty much it. The, the headpiece is the main focus there. This looks pretty close to a standard weapon for, for Orisa. Same with the bongo. Union Jack, it's bringing back that old school theme of um, the flags. We had a lot of these in the beginning. Remember how many flag skins we had in the early summer games? The epic skins are very good. I think they're good too. All right, then we'll go into legendaries for one last time. Batiste, a lot of you guys like this one. I saw a lot of nines and tens for this one. This is not really one of my favorites, but if you play a lot of him, then uh, this is going to be your go-to. His weapon is definitely the best thing. It's a coconut gun. Shooting out little coconuts. And this design of the leaf is really cool. I love this like this uh, print or this illustration on it. Looks really good. He's so fresh. Uh, Feskarn, which is a uh, Gothenburg way of saying fisherman woman, I guess. The net for catching fish. Oh, dude, how did I not even see? There's literal fish on her waist. How did it? My eyes. My eyes. You guys are probably calling this out. There's actual fish there hanging off. What does it say on the back? Oh, Hanas? I can't read that. I got to see that up closer. Oh, nah. If anyone knows what this says, let me know too. Shoot me a tweet. Send it to my Facebook. Uh, FB.GG slash Onickel. Once again, guys, don't forget to drop a thumbs up if you haven't already. Subscribe to channel notifications on. And also, come to the daily live streams over on FB.GG. Happy birthday to uh, Belize. All right. And this is Doomfist Karate. I got to get this for sure. I have to get the karate skin right here. This one's dope. I like this one. It's it's simple. It's like a lot more simple than a lot of the other ones, but I, I still like it, the concept and everything. Surf's Up. This one is... I think this one is probably my favorite, though, of all of these legendaries. This one's really cool. All right, and last of all, last but not least, we have Farrah. So that is the last one. I'll show you her gun real fast. It looks very nice. <clears throat> but if you guys enjoyed the video, I'm just going to end it right here. I don't want to make this too long. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And come over to the live stream on fb.gg slash onickel. Drop a thumbs up, and we'll see you guys there. Thank you guys all for kicking it. Let me know your favorite skins down below in the chat, and check out the new videos that are coming out very, very